The first basketball game in the now JMA Wireless Dome wasn't the prettiest for Syracuse. Indiana University of Pennsylvania was in complete control for 30 minutes of this exhibition, but in the final 10, Syracuse flipped the switch and looked like a Division I team, beating IUP 86-68. The freshman class, plenty of hype coming into the season, and they proved tonight that they're legit and belong in the college game. He made a couple really good plays, pass plays, and he's tough, physical goes and gets it. That rebound they call the foul and wasn't a foul. He goes after, he knows how to play. Um, yeah, I think he sees the game like a point guard, even though he's big enough to play at two or three. I know I'm not in control of how many shots I make. I'm not in control if I can t turn the ball. I'm not even in control if I'm having a bad day. I know what's under what I can control is my energy and the energy of the team. And that's what I do every day in practice. Every day, like, it's just, that's just me. I'm just the energy guy regardless. It felt good uh, being able to see some of the fans, you know, playing in the dome. You know, it's a, it's a big atmosphere. Most people get nervous, but I was ready for it, for sure. I think we're definitely underrated. Uh, guys like Quadir, a lot of people thought he was in a red shirt, but as you can see, he's a real player. So we got pieces. We, everybody does different things. We're good at different things. So I think we'll all be able to come together and, and collab with the seniors and juniors that we have on this team. Judah Mintz led this freshman group with 14 points, 12 of those coming in a second half that the Orange outscored the Crimson Hawks 54 to 35. Exhibition number two and the final one will be next Tuesday right here in the Dome against Southern New Hampshire University. Reporting inside the Dome, Nick Zelaya, Citrus TV.